This is the sound that most residents heard while walking by Fricker Hall Monday night. At 5.15 Monday evening, a steam valve on the south end of Fricker Hall opened, causing steam to puff out sporadically. I was just up in my room all over in Benson, and I started hearing this poof, 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 and it, wouldn't, it was going for like a good 20 minutes before I finally got up and was like, what is that? And I look outside and I saw the smoke coming out of the building. The building was evacuated after a heat sensor triggered the building's fire alarms. The alarm also signaled three fire trucks to arrive and assess the situation. Campus police and firefighters held off residents from entering the area while utility crews looked for a solution to the problem. We're surmising a high pressure steam trap failed and what that does is it lets the high pressure into the low pressure side of the system and that was a relief valve exploding over there. And if that doesn't happen, the pipes inside the building will explode, so it's a safety wow. device. So the broken valve was really a safety device, and it's a good thing it worked. At about 6.30, utility workers shut off the steam intake to Fricker Hall, and residents were allowed back into the building more than an hour after being evacuated. For UWW-TV News, I'm Kyle Johns.